I'm Shay Schrader. I'm a pastor here at Harmon Memorial Baptist Church. We are located in Grundy, Virginia, which is in the southwest part of Virginia. Uh, we are a coal mining community, as has happened in a lot of industries. Coal in about 2008 took kind of a downturn. We went through a little bit of a rough phase where we've had a lot of layoffs and a lot of people have had to move away uh, just due, due to find work. I guess in early 2000, uh, there was a major oxycotton problem in our area and really in southwest Virginia one of the main things that's happening is a lot of grandparents are raising kids. In March 2015 I uh, attended the wildfire conference where KOZ had a table set up and just kind of read about it and took it in and there in February of 2016 uh, we actually began our, our KOZ program. I'm Mary Beth and I'm Stephen's mom. Let's pump. Stephen was diagnosed with high functioning autism, also known as Asperger's, when Stephen was in second grade. Stephen um, struggled socially quite a bit, even trying to go to Sunday school. There would be some Sundays that he could, um, many that he could not. And sometimes he would sit outside of the classroom. And Stephen grew the anxiety um, at school, got extremely severe. It was very severe, and to get him to go into a class, even at school, was very difficult. He loves the outdoors. He loves fishing and hunting and shooting, and those were the things that Stephen loved to do. So when KOZ started, Stephen went, and I was a little nervous on how he was going to do because I didn't know how he was going to interact with, with the leaders. I had come to pick Stephen up one, uh, one Saturday afternoon, and this is the first time that this ever in, in his little life had ever happened to me. Um, they had had a all night, they had had a sleepover, and they had been fishing. And I came to pick up Stephen, and he came around the side of the building, and he saw my face, and he said, oh, are you here to get me? <laughs> that never happened to me before. He was always ready to go. Many times, anywhere else he would go, um, he just couldn't stay or I would have to pick him up early. He wasn't ready to leave. And that is the first time, really, that um, I had really ever experienced that with him. When Stephen first came to KOZ, I guess he didn't really know a whole lot of us real good. He'd talk a little bit and nod his head and stuff. And over the past year and a half, I mean, Stephen's become like, like one of my best friends. I mean, I can joke and cut up with him and just out of time aggravating one another. I bet you can't put the same bullet two times in one hole. My 30 out six scope was off. He's matured a lot more and the stuff we talk about and stuff. Sometimes it's kind of like sitting and talking to another man a grown up. God has helped me through KLZ because one point in school, I was having a rough point, and so I think this ministry has helped uh, help me uh, help us all a lot. Shannon helped me through a si certain situation, and that's I think how the good Lord has sent sent him sent them all to us. All that I can really do is rejoice and praise the Lord for this ministry, and I I tell the guys this is the best ministry one of them in our church. It is, um, it is strengthening Stephen and teaching him godly principles that he will carry on with him for the rest of his life. It is teaching him to be a man and what it is to be a man of God with integrity. They do it in a way that Stephen um, can relate. I don't think he's realizing that he's learning and they're pouring this into these young, young boys. For um, KOZ, we come to church on Sundays and after or after KOZ, I mean, we actually, we've got Bible study now. We're more involved in the church now. We drove up and down Harmon, which is right here in our community, and stopped at the mouth of every holler on Harmon and just prayed specifically that if there were any young men up in those hollers or boys who could benefit from the KOZ ministry, that somehow, some way, that God would make a way for them to hear about KOZ and that they could come and participate in that ministry. 
one of the first books I, I read when I got saved says if you see God at work, join him. And I believe KOZ is a place that God's at work and therefore that's one of the reasons we chose to join. There's not enough positive things that could be said for the way these men have uh, surrounded Stephen and supported him and encouraged him. Mary Beth. My name is Stephen. My name is Shannon. I'm Shay. And I'm Belinda. And, and we, we are KOZ. I am KOZ. I am KOZ. And I am KOZ.